video is brought to you by G2A.com for cheap games, MSP and PSN codes. And powered by Elgato Gaming. Hey guys, how's it going? Master Bucks here and welcome to another 2025 Crew Mode video and today we're going to be looking at another one of the best up and coming players in modern football, one of the best midfielders in the era Davizi, it is Rashedli Bazor. This man is another one of the brilliant centre midfielders to get in career mode this year, some absolute stunners, guys like of course one we've already done, Yuri Tielemans, this guy right up there. And when I think of a guy like Bazor, I think of guys like, you know, Paul Pogba, Yaya Toure and even back in the day, not a career mode pickup anymore, but back in the day like a Patrick Vieira, hell he's got the potential to really go on and be someone like that. He is an exceptional young talent for sure, and he has himself an extremely high potential of 88. So you can imagine, with the great stats he already has, which we will go through in depth in a second, how good they're going to be, plus 10, plus 12, if he can reach that potential. Let's take a look. So let's take a look at Bazor's stats. 75 rated, but he's now recently gotten an upgrade to 76, not too long ago. You see the mental and physical, super all-rounded. You've got no stat lower than around 65, and it also goes both ways with his skill attributes, Things like his freaky accuracy, his penalties, and uh, things like that, they're a little bit not great, and obviously his goalkeeping, but everything else is 60 and above. Very well rounded. You know I'm a sucker for players like that. 18 years of age, six foot to six feet, uh, six foot tall, uh, from the Netherlands, can only play at central midfield, but I'm sure you could play him. You could play him at CDM or center attacking mid if you really wanted to. No specialities, no traits. He's got three star weak foot, three star skill moves, and a heck of a potential. And I know there are a lot of you out there that have been waiting for this moment because this guy is an absolutely popular pickup right now and a plus two increase in his first season in this season anyway like we have with the previous few players that we've done 2025 career modes with you see a lot of growth in the mental and the technical and very little help none in the physical but there you go there's a little bit of growth in the technical not every stat has gone up but some by a fair bit some by a little bit but plus two it's a humble start for certain but he can definitely do better than that plus two if he were to grow by plus two in every season he'd hit his potential but anyway Rashedli Bazor in this one again plus two now 79 rated at 20 years of age. Even though he's in some bad form, he's still growing by plus two. I'm not sure why he would be. He's a beast of a player. But anyway, still no physical attribute growth that you can see. Mental's really coming along quite well. And some individual technical attributes that are going up by plus one. Again, maybe not as great a season as last season. He really should be doing a bit better. One would argue anyway. But hell, it's still plus four in his first two seasons. But can he have a great and absolutely rocking third season? He can't, but he can get to plus. He can get to an AT rating, which is good. The plus one. So that's five increase to his overall in three seasons. Not too bad. He just needs eight more to go until he can fulfill that potential of his. So there we go then. Very little growth to his mental and technical. Very almost no growth to his physical, but it's still okay. You see those stats very well rounded and he's got some great passing and ball control and things like that. Really coming together. So we have now hit the AT rating with Bazaar. Will we be able to go on and fulfill that potential or supersede it? Only time will tell. Let's go all the way to 2025. So here we are, 2025 with Bazor. He didn't have a great start, but he didn't have a poor start. Plus five in your first three, but he's really got to kick it up. I think he can do it. Can he get to that potential? What's his rating in 2025? He has done it. He's got his potential of 88 on the final season. Plus one with his technical attributes really kicking it. And you see his mental attributes starting to drop off. Very slight increases to his physical attributes, but still. Look at them stats. Super well-rounded. He's only got one stat, or should I say two stats, that aren't that great in his technical really anywhere. And that's his free kick accuracy and his penalties. But that's okay. I mean, you get other players to take free kicks, other players to take penalties. Everything else looks stunning. 90 plus passing, 90 plus ball control, 97 ball control to be exact. Some great stats, 80 rated stats, some uh, round mid 70 stats as well. Super well rounded, beautiful player. He really does strike me and remind me as one of those Paul Pogba S players at 88 rated. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. And that's just with his natural potential, guys. You can absolutely invest some drills in player training on him and he will get to that rating even faster. He'll probably get even better than that if you're willing to get, uh, if you're willing to put the work in with him. He would be an absolutely superb player. A brilliant pickup, no denying that and he would be stunning to your team. But that's it for this one though guys thank you so much for watching another 2025 crew mode video and until the next one my name is master bucks don't forget to leave in the comment section down below who you'd like me to do next and have a good one bye bye